Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you all the stuff I bought this week. Um, it's just random stuff. Uh, stuff for my daughter's birthday, some Etsy decor, a Mother's Day gift that I got for my husband, and just some random other things we needed. So I'm going to start with what I got from Amazon. Um, I needed a new pair of sunglasses for this summer, so I got these. They're Sojo's brand. They came in this case and they are, ooh, they're very, they're mirrored. So you can see all my junk around. I'll show you them on. Do, do, do. Okay. So I got those, they were 12 or $13, I believe. Then I think they were 12 or $13 again. They came in a five pack of knee high socks. I think they said nine to 18 months, which my daughter's 11 months, but she's in nine month clothes right now. But I thought these would be cute for the spring, summer, fall. They'll probably fit her a while because they look pretty big. So they came in black and they're like a little ruffled up here. Whoops. So we got black, this really pretty plush pink, classic gray. Um, this is like a white or off white and a tan creamy tan. Okay, I'm in a book club with some of my girlfriends and we got a new book. It's called Where the Crawl Dads Sing by Delia Owens. This was $11 on Amazon in hardback. It was cheaper hardback than the other one. I'm not gonna lie, I don't really read a whole lot but we started this book club in January and I've read three, no, two of the three books. This is the fourth one. So hopefully it sounds really good. Um, I've never read anything by this author. I don't even know, but I'm going to try it out. So I need to make some time to read before bed. Okay. I also got a drying rack for my kitchen for it goes over the sink and then it like folds up so it will be out of the way it's a classic gray gray and i believe oh, oh it has the brand on here supas supas i don't know and i think this was 25 dollars and okay, so we're updating our, I don't know if you want to call it updating or remodeling, our whole entire house with new paint and trim and like new lighting fixtures and all that stuff. So the kitchen will be last. We're going to redo the flooring, but we are just like with the Fiesta wear I got, we're replacing a bunch of new, we want to get new pots and pans, but we might ask for those for Christmas because they can be pretty pricey if it's a really nice set which is what we want because we want it to last years and years. Um, so I got a new cutting board, which my husband wasn't really happy about, but it was only $20. I don't see the brand on here. Oh, it's on the back. Seville Classics. And so it's this bamboo cutting board. It's huge. And then it comes and you have all your different mats so you can cut certain things on them. So that one's for chicken. Um, I mean, I guess I don't really need to show you, but they have chicken, veggies, beef, cheese, bread, fish, and this one's and the black one is blank. So then you just wipe these down. It's dishwasher safe. I thought it was really cute. Um, 
Tiffany Beeston has it and she swears by it. She's had it for years. Um, so of course, you know, I wanted to check it out. All right, that's it from Amazon. Next, I'll show you um, what I got from Walmart and Target. Okay, from Walmart, I picked up, I love this scent and I wish I should go to Bath and Body Works because I know they have a cucumber and melon and it's the foaming kind that I like. But I got the Soft Soap Crisp Cucumber and Melon. It was for $1.98 at Walmart. We have this soap at my work and I'm obsessed with the smell. It's so fresh and crisp. It's exactly crisp cucumber and melon. That's exactly what it smells like and it is my new favorite. Uh, also from Walmart. You'll see why, but I picked up these hair ribbons. And they're like the stretchy headband. Um, this pack of three was for a dollar. I really only wanted the white one, but this is all they had. And it was the last one. But I'm going to use this white one to make a tutu for my daughter's birthday pictures, which are next week. And it's watermelon theme, so I'm going to show you all the stuff I got for that too. But anyways, I'm going to try to attempt to make a tutu. Okay, that's it from Walmart from Target. I picked up some toothpaste. The Dollar Spot, they put out some, or Bullseye Playground, they put out some more things. I got this. It's, I don't know, I th just decor. Because like I said, we're redoing the basement. It's almost finished and I need to decorate so that was three dollars and just in case we go to the pool or the beach this summer i got a pack i got one thing of towel clips and those were three dollars i could not help myself because it's watermelon it's a watermelon squishy and believe it that was three dollars if you tell me i think that should have been one dollar but who am i oh. oh this was the only watermelon they had left but i'm gonna set it out for the party or i might just play with it and the last thing i got from target was a shower tension rod from room essentials and i think here i have the receipt this was 9.99 and i'm going to put it underneath our kitchen sink so i can hang up all of my cleaning supplies that i've spent all my money on so I'm going to organize that. Maybe I should do a organizing video. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, before I get to... Well, okay. So with this headband, I got some stuff to make a tutu. So I got the Glimmer Tool. And I got... Whoa! This is, all, this is from Joanne's Fabric. Or Joanne Fabric. I got a light pink... A darker pink. Can you see that? <laughs> a white and oh, there it is. A like green. So I'm gonna cut those and put them on. To make her tutu. Um, the other thing I'm going to try to make for her birthday is a high chair banner garland. Um, I want to put the letters one O N E on there. Um, I need to go to the scrapbook store to get that, but I have more time. Her pictures are next weekend, so I need to make the tutu. Um, but for the garland, I got these fabric squares, or for her high chair garland. I got two in white with some silver speckles. I got three in light pink. 
I got three in a darker pink. And I got two with a green and they do have a shimmery sparkle to them. So I thought those would be cute. And then I also picked up a thing of ribbon that has the exact same colors with watermelon. So I can add some of that in there too. And all of that from Joann's. I'm sure they had coupons. It looks like my little fabric was a dollar each and I got 10 of those. And then the tool, they were five dollars each and then the watermelon um ribbon was 4.79 so that was pretty pricey but maybe i'll reuse i don't know who knows okay this is my favorite okay so for um some decor for our basement i ordered this off of line and it is from an Etsy shop called Grace and Jewels and I threw away like the little business card but she handmade these books with our names on them and here's the top they're real books and then she painted those and then printed our names and I used my full name because I thought it looked nicer but how cute is that going to be? I'm going to buy a ladder bookshelf and hopefully put this on there. And then it came early, but for an early Mother's Day present, I told my husband what I wanted and he got it for me. It's from Grace Personalized. It's another Etsy shop and I'm already wearing it, but it's a little dainty ring with our daughter's name on it her name is Adeline I don't know if this is gonna I don't know if that's gonna be able to show let me put it back on my finger I don't know maybe I'll take a picture if you want to see it up close for my daughter's um smash cake pictures next week or on Saturday um I got an outfit for her and then she'll wear it again to her birthday party, which isn't until June, but I'm going to show you guys it. I need to try it on and make sure it fits her, but the Etsy shop is called Lily and Max Children's Boutique. There is a little... I got it in the 6 to 12 month size. Here's the onesie. It says one in a melon and it's pink and it has these little ruffle... Things. And then in the back, it's crisscrossed. And then it came with these pants. This is actually the front. And then the back is just that plain. So, this is super cute. Um, I love Etsy. Okay. And then... The last thing I'll show you that I picked up, well, I ordered the design off of Etsy. I can't remember what the, the stop, shop was called. I think it was like Fox Illustrations. Um, and then you had to print them on your own. So I just did a cardstock at Staples and picked them up. I'm going to block off the bottom part because it has my address. But otherwise I'll show you the invite. So it says, our little sweetie is one in a melon. Join us to celebrate Adeline's first birthday party. And then on the back, it was just this plain pink watermelon dots. But I asked if she could put a picture that I took. We did that little photo shoot. And I think it turned out pretty cute. So that's my daughter. And... Yeah, that's it. I'll, I'm going to show you guys if I get the tutu made. I'm going to do a haul of all my her birthday decor and a gift ideas and that kind of thing. So stay tuned if you want to see that. 
Otherwise, thank you for watching my video on what I bought this weekend. And please subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.